Go. Welcome once again to a new edition of Bacon in the Oven, the foremost Baconologist blog in all of the interwebs. For today, we're doing a silly hat edition of Bacon in the Oven. What we got on uh, on tap in store, we got uh, we got some uh, some chicken uh, sausage. We'll be wrapping those, of course, with bacon because how else do you eat it? Right here, some ground chuck. We're gonna be doing. Hey, how's it going again? We're gonna be doing some bacon infused burgers. We're gonna be grilling up some bacon. Uh, we're gonna get a nice pan fry, and then boom, we're gonna make some mix that in with our with our ground chuck. We're gonna get that. See here, we've got some asparagus. Asparagus uh, properly provided to us by the kind folks of Publix, as you can tell, as most of the products were. We're going to be wrapping our asparagus with bacon and then grilling it. That's going to be important because we're going to need toothpicks. It's going to be kind of a mess, but we're really looking forward to seeing the outcome. For our bacon supplies, Publix was good enough to put some sale items up uh, for grabs for us. We've got brown sugar and hardwood smoke because, you know, one type of bacon, never enough. We've got a rolls, got a rolls, got a rolls. Got mini cigars to match up with our crazy hat day. Uh, we've got a fedora for our camera lady slash baconologist, Miss Lauren. She'll be wearing that and looking pretty as always. There you go. And then uh, to wash it all down, we've got some hard cider, pear flavored. Why pear flavored? Because God forbid we get anything normal. So, welcome back to Bacon in the Oven. We're going to mash all this up and make ourselves some good food. Stay tuned. It's going to get messy. <laughs> 